Jefferson is my personal obsession in part also from having grown up at the University of Virginia. And because he is in the moment of penning the Declaration of Independence, doing an extraordinary thing that many in the political world fail to do in this moment, which is to say he writes an aspirational document. And this aspirational document is key to the thing that continues to make America an interesting project from my viewpoint. He writes, we hold these truths to be self-evident that all persons are created equal, endowed by their creator with certain inalienable rights, and among these are life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness, and that to secure these rights, governments are instituted among persons deriving their just powers from consent of the governed. These are good sentences. They are not empirically in evidence at, in any way on the Monticello Mountain in the 18th century. There is nothing less self-evident in 1776 than the human equality of all persons. And as much as the Constitution ends up being a slave document and a document that instantiates inequality, the Declaration of Independence is not. It is just a damn good bad check. Right? It, is, right? it is MLK who later calls it the check that is written that has come back right, with insufficient funds. But it is better that the check be written because then it is clear that a debt is owed. Right? If no aspirational document exists, if no words begin the democratic project that is self-governance of the American people saying that there is self-evident human equality and that the whole point of a government and the entire capacity to know that it is just is that it derives its powers from consent of the governed. So what I want to suggest is that that is the aspirational document with which we begin and which we therefore have a right to adjudicate the health of our own political system over and against. Because we have said it. Someone else didn't say it. It's not some communist manifesto. It's our own red-headed Jefferson on the Monticello Mountain thinking the big thoughts of the Enlightenment. Mm -hmm.